Wayne entered the passcode of her boyfriend's apartment. Once it granted her the access, she went in. She just returned from university as she placed the bag away and looked at Jungkook sitting on the couch. The huge LED in front of him playing the game he was currently immersed in. He had his headphones on. She walked towards him, sneaking her arms around his neck as she stood behind the couch. Kissing his cheek, she took his attention. Her kisses moved down his cheek and jaw. He took her affection while continuing to play his game. Her eyes landed on the alcohol mug placed on the table in front of him, and she sighed. She retreated her arms and started walking away. Jungkook didn't take a moment. He threw his headphones and controllers away as he gripped her arm. Jungkook, what happened? Where are you going, love? Wayan, I told you to stop over drinking. Once in a while is okay, but every day you drown yourself in it. That's only going to make you an alcoholic, Jungkook. Jungkook pulled her to his lap. He wrapped his arms around her waist tightly, not letting her go. Jungkook, we talked over this baby. I try, but sometimes I want it. Wayan, Jungkook, I don't have a problem with you drinking. I do. Everyone does. You should really, but this much, you will become an addict. Jungkook noticed the fear in her eyes. He felt it was not only it, there was something else. Jungkook, let's play around. Who loses, does what the other says. She agreed, fixing herself in his lap as she faced the screen. Jungkook gave one controller to her and took one himself. The game started. The two chased to finish the game trying to kill one another in the process. Instantly getting lost in the game and competition, the whole apartment got filled with their screams of sometimes happiness and the other times frustration. One round followed another and then another, till they were simply enjoying the game. Wayan, that's cheating, alright? You are simply good at it. You play it all the time. She groaned, but he laughed. Seeing him laugh was enough to bring a smile on her lips as she pecked the moles on his face. Wine, can't even stay angry at you. Jungkook turned her towards him. He reached out to take a glass of alcohol only for his hand to be slapped back to himself. He smirked, wrapping his arms around her waist. Jungkook, what to do? I think I have already become an addict. He left a butterfly, sloppy kiss on her chin. His voice dark and husky. Jungkook, do you know leaving one addiction is easier when you have something even better to be addicted to? Wayan, don't tell me you want to do drugs next. Jungkook, oh baby, he smirked, his thumb tracing on her low lip. She felt the tension rising as the distance between the two kept reducing. Jungkook, that's yours to decide. Give me something better than alcohol and I'll leave it. His eyes landed on her lips. The lust in his eyes was so evident. It had enough power to twist her insides and bring her to a next level of player and satisfaction. Wayan, do you think you can get it so easily? She smirked, getting in her playful mood too. Jungkook took challenges really well. He was a gamer after all. You don't want to ever challenge those. He rolled on the couch, pinning her down on it as he hovered above her. 
She loved every time he took control. Jungkook, where will you run off to now? He kissed her passionately, which she returned without wasting a second. Before they knew, it turned into a heated make-out session, which none of them wanted to pull back from. She pulled on his hair and he bit her lower lip. As he pulled back, he had a satisfied smirk on his face. Jungkook, no alcohol could beat this addiction. He kissed her again and laid beside her afterwards. Wine, you'll try to stop it? Jungkook, I will. First, you tell me the whole thing. She got quiet for a moment. Jungkook had the ability to read through her every time without her even giving him a hint. Wine, my father was an alcoholic. He started like this too, then before any of us knew, he was drinking all the time. It was like drugs he couldn't function without. He would beat mom all the time, he lost control of his senses. Wyan, if he wouldn't get it on time, he would be like a madman. He wasted all of his money there. The business started going down the drain. Of course, a man drowned in addiction who had no senses left in him, couldn't handle himself, let alone a whole business. Jungkook never thought like that. His mind never went there. He didn't drink that much. His door was way. Too much less, but Wyan's fear was valid. Wyan, mom took a divorce and we thankfully got separated. Before this, their relationship was going quite well. He kissed her temple and locked his hands around her hair. Jungkook, I'm sorry I had to go through all of this. But you won't ever again. I won't let you near anything like this. Wyan, I know you don't drink that much. And I'm sorry for getting upset at you all the time. But every time I get reminded of him. And it scares me too much. Let me just... He stood up and grabbed the mug and spilled the contents in the sink. He grabbed the few bottles he had in the cabinet and threw them away too, regardless of how expensive they were. Nothing mattered more than her. Jungkook, I will limit it to once or twice a week. He said coming back to cows and plopped down on it pulling her on his lap. Jungkook, how about you keep me busy till then? He winked and she chuckled kissing him again. He knew so well how to distract her and make her feel special all the time.